Yo, what is going on, everybody? My name is JX Kicks, and I want to welcome you guys back to this channel. Today we have another review, and like always, I'm so happy to be reviewing some shoes today. And I was expecting this shoe. I wanted this shoe for. Uh, I'm not gonna say some time because it just released, but um, ever since the leaked images came out, and you know, what I'm saying everything was kind of like being shown. I was so happy. I was so excited to get these. Um, if you guys don't know what I'm talking about, today is December 30th, 2022. What today's release was, was the Air Jordan 2 Chicago. Um, my hair is completely messed up, ignore my hair. But um, today was the release of the Air Jordan 2 Chicago. And just like the Air Jordan 1 Chicago, this is like a reimagined version of things. Um, and just like the Lost and Found pair, I was able to pick up a grade school pair that would fit me, a size seven. Because Jordan 2s, for some odd reason, they run big. And I didn't know that when I got the Union Jordan 2s, if you go watch my other video. But, uh, yeah, I got to double sock the Unions. But that's besides the point. So, like I said, this is a grade school pair. So, they mess up our personal pairs when it comes to the boxes. If you look if you look at the men's pairs, they got, like, the nice Jordan 2 box with the nice sticker and the nice player, the, uh, the, the sneaker card, the Jordan card. It looks aesthetically pleasing. When you get a grade school pair, you get a box. But that's besides the point we're here to look at the shoes. I would have liked to get the sneaker card, but it don't be happening. So we got a regular Jordan box, unfortunately, but that is okay. We're here for the shoes. Like I said, size seven, Air Jordan 2 Retro GS. This is, like I said, a grade school pair. And yes, sir, get into it. So, like any other grade school pair, you get your Jordan sticker. It's not a Jordan player card or anything. It's just a Jordan sticker, which is so depressing because I got like a hundred of these. And I would prefer the sneaker card, but it is what it is. Boo-hoo. But here it is, the Air Jordan 2 Chicago. Um, I'm, I was happy to get these when I first seen them. Surprisingly, not a lot of people, it's not really surprising because not a lot of people like Jordan 2s, but I was so excited to get this pair because I love Jordan 2s. I love how comfortable they feel. Today, I was wearing the Union 2s to pick up the Jordan 2 Chicago, and I'm like, today was just a, a, a Tuesday, no pun intended, because today's not Tuesday. But yes, this is the Air Jordan 2 Chicago. Um, the gray school pair is just like the gray school pair from back in 1986. Um, and if you guys don't recognize the shape or cut, like I said, this is the 1986 style that it has. Now, one thing I do complain about this shoe. Well, there's nothing to complain about this shoe, to be honest. This shoe is so gorgeous. The materials are fire. Um, everything was just made, in my opinion, to perfection. I just don't see a whole problem with this. But the only problem I have, like I said, is the box and like the aesthetics of it. For a grade school pair, you get trash. But the sneaker itself is it's it's beautiful. So let's take a look at the uh, the sneaker. So to start off is all white upper with a red accent in the back, the red tab. Um, the leather is pretty much that soft buttery leather. I'm not gonna say like too buttery, but it is buttery. You can see the little creases popping up when you touch it. Um, I don't know if you see that. Anyway, you can't because the lighting is terrible as always. Um, this is this leather is covering most of the shoe itself so you got the, the toe box you got the well, you got the toe toe box that's covered with the same leather you got this type of material on here i don't know what this is this is leather but i don't know if they engraved the uh the crocodile looking type thing or if they just use an actual type of material that has this feeling to it um i have no clue but I enjoy the sex of the Jordan 2. After that, you get a regular pair of black laces. The eyelids, the uh, the lace lids, they're regular plastic, just like the men's pair, so that's a good thing. The gray shoe pair is just like the men's pair. The only difference is that it's the box. <laughs> the box. <laughs> I'm gonna complain about that all time, all the time, like this whole video. But the eyelids itself is the same. The eye uh, drones appear the same. It got the exact three on top. Um, usually when it comes to Jordan 1s, I don't know if anybody else notices, but with mids, you get like one less. And that's because it is a mid. Like with uh, high uh, Jordan 1 high OG, you get nine holes. 
eyelids or eyelids or whatever you call them and then with um a mid top you get eight but sometimes you get seven on the mid top pair for grade school and i don't know why but it does happen but in this case we do have all the number holes correctly which is one two three four five six seven eight for the jordan two next um like i said it's covering all white you do have the red back tab with the brim on it which uh, which i was so excited about because the jordan 2 union doesn't have the brit the the rich it doesn't it's just like a suede no and which is so annoying to me but in the ogs we do have the the, the rib whatever it's called which i find to be aesthetically pleasing the nike logo in the back that looks so og which is awesome i can't bro i'm yes this is what we wanted this is what we wanted like after that you get your jordan tongue you know your jordan logo on the tongue air jordan i thought this was pretty okay i feel like the cut could have been better but on like how they cut it and you don't stitch it i feel like it could have been better but not every factory is you know perfect you know what i'm saying they're not perfect at all so i can take the little john on that the midsole itself is regular black um and then the outsole is red black and white mostly being white and red with a little black paint on the middle with the nike logo on there if you see the Jordan 1.5, it has, I think, a Jordan, you know, name to it. But with the Jordan 2s, it has Nike. On the other side, you get the same thing. Obviously, because it's the same shoe. It's not a what the color or anything. But yeah, let me know what you guys think in the comment section below about the Air Jordan 2 Chicago and the reimagined state that it was in for this 2022. Like I said, I'm so excited. Like... If you haven't had a chance to cop this pair, I'm pretty sure you're going to get this pair for at least retail or a little bit above retail. I don't see this sneaker going above more than... Grade school is 140. They probably go up to like 160, 170. And then for men, it's 200. I don't see it going up to more than like 230, in my opinion. Like, I don't see it going up anymore. But let me know what you guys think in the comment section below about these Air Jordan 2s. I think these are fire. I think this is another 10 out of 10 that we have for this year. This is a good way to end off the year. Just like the Lost and Founds, this is one of the best ways to end off the year with an OG Jordan with an OG colorway. And yeah, I think these are was per these was perfect. Yeah, let me know what you guys like I said multiple times. Let me know what you guys think in the comment section below. Is this a cop? Is this a drop? Do you like the Air Jordan 2? Or do you think that this is the most hideous thing you've ever seen in your life? I think these are fire. This is one of my favorite models, the one, the twos, and the fives. And yeah, this is JX6 signing out. Once again, comment, like, subscribe. I appreciate you guys' support. We hit 70 subscribers, and that's not a lot to some people, but for me, where I'm from, that that's that's a blessing because you know you never get too far in life. I don't want to get sentimental, but I'm grateful for 70 subscribers to what we had. Let's try to hit 100, and then we'll make our way up from there. But I'm happy that we even got to 70, the double digits itself. Not a lot of YouTubers get that chance, but I am grateful that you guys gave me the opportunity to go above 50 subscribers. So let's hit that 100, and let's keep on going from there. But yeah, comment, like, subscribe. I'll see you guys later. This is JX6 signing out with these Air Jordan 2 Chicago's. Peace.